Hi and welcome to the first Christmas craft from our special Christmas craft kit. Grab that if you haven't already and join us for a really special craft. Today we're going to be making an advent calendar. So you're going to need some of the things in this bag. Now it's going to take quite a bit of work. So Zara and I are going to do this together, but I think it'll be worth it because it's going to give you a month full of lots of fun. So here's what you need out of your bag. You need pieces of paper that have lots of pictures on them. You need to grab that little booklet as well. And there are some pieces of paper that have activities on them, those ones. You need to grab the numbers, okay? So there's a piece of paper with lots of numbers on it. And there are lots of little brown envelopes in different sizes. You need those. You need to find the string that's in there. And then at the bottom of your bag, there are lots of little metal paper clips, one for each day in December leading up to Christmas. So that's 25. Okay. See if you can find all 25 metal paper clips. They're really yeah. small. Yeah, they are small. You will also need some glue and a pair of scissors. Okay, we're gonna do some cutting and sticking today. So that's the first thing we're gonna do. We're going to cut out our numbers, our activities and our pictures. And we need to be careful that we remember to keep the small pictures together, which are these two pages. And then we've got some bigger pictures and we'll keep those together as well. Okay, you ready to join us? Yeah. Let's get cutting. That's the first thing we need to do. We'll see you in a minute. So now that we've got everything ready, we need to number up the envelopes. Now this is a little bit complicated so you need to really concentrate, okay? You might want to write the numbers on the envelopes or you might want to separate the numbers that you've already cut out so that you know what number goes on what size of envelope, okay? So here's how it goes. Numbers one, two, three, four, five, and six are all small. So look out six envelopes and put the numbers one to six and stick those on top, okay? So using your glue, stick the numbers one to six on top of those envelopes. We'll see you in a minute. When we've done that, you can do it as well, okay? Yeah. Number seven, it's different. Seven goes on one of the bigger envelopes, one of these square ones. So Zara, if you do number seven, okay. put that on there. Yep, I will. Eight and nine, they're small envelopes. Okay, so eight and nine are small. Okay, so now that we have all the numbers, all the envelopes labelled up, we need to match the number on these little Bible verse cards because every day we're going to read another little part of the Christmas story as it's told in the Bible. Like little chapters. Yeah, little verses, but we need to match these with the pictures and the envelopes. So this might take a little bit of time. So if you are very clever, you will have cut the pictures out in order because they were in order on the sheet. But if not, it's okay. 
I'll put a photograph so that you know which number matches which picture. So, day one, Mary. There's a picture for Mary. Okay, so you find that picture, put it together with day number one, and there's one more thing you're gonna put into the envelope. So I'll give you those, Zara, you can put those mm -hmm. in. There are these little activity cards. Now it doesn't matter what envelope these activity cards go in. You can put them in any envelope. But I do want to point something out, okay? One of these cards says, have a special friend over for dinner. Well, we can't do that at the moment, can we? Because of the virus. So maybe you could help to make dinner for somebody and take it to a friend. Wouldn't that be a nice idea? Be or maybe we can look forward to having friends over for dinner sometime in the future. But what we do have, maybe you'll leave that one out for this year. We have lots of little blank cards. And so you can write your own ideas That's of activities that you can do each day for some of the days. Mm -hmm. You can write your own if you've got some good ideas. So let's put in, do a puzzle together, puzzle together on day one. Okay, day two. We've got to put that with the angel. So find the angel picture and put that with day two. And don't forget, put in an activity. Uh -huh. And that's all you need to do. Have a look at the little verse card. Find the picture that matches. Mm -hmm. Choose an activity and put them into your envelopes. And keep going until you get to day 24. Right. We'll see you when you've done that mm -hmm. and we've done that too. So we've done up to day 24, now it's just day 25. You might not want to do an activity on day 25 because I think you might be very busy that day. What yeah. do you think, Zara? Christmas yeah. Day, it's a busy one already. But maybe you'll take time in the day to read the little verse and you might even have time to read this little book that tells us a little bit about the Christmas story. Just to help you remember that Christmas is when we remember that Jesus came into the world as a little baby. We'll put these, now it's going to be a tight fit, it doesn't quite fit, but we'll put these into day 25 yes. and we can read those together in our houses on Christmas Day. Okay so now that that's all done the last thing we need to do is we need to make this advent calendar. Yeah. So we're going to take the string and you'll hang it somewhere and you'll put the paper clips onto the envelopes in order Oh, and hang them. Can you hold that for me, Zara? Yep. Hang them onto the string. And you should have enough string to hang all the numbers. And each day you can take off a new envelope. <laughs> we'll do that now. You can do it and then decide where we're going to hang it in the house as we look forward to Christmas Day. Well, there we go. Good job, Zara. That was a lot of work. Mm -hmm. But I know we are going to have a lot of fun with this. Yeah. Thank you for helping me. I hope you enjoyed me helping you. I hope you have a great time making this advent calendar and even more fun opening the envelopes each mm -hmm. day. We'll see you again next week for another Christmas mm -hmm. craft. Yay. Bye. Bye. Thank you.